when NASCAR uh, unveiled the 2019 rules, they really targeted how to make races better at the mile and a half, like Kansas Speedway. You know, I don't think anybody knows what to anticipate, but I do know what I hope I see. Three wide, two wide, a groove up top, groove on the bottom, drafting. I'd like to see some of that tonight. It had a huge effect on the race today. It's going to be a really fun race. Check a shot of winning it. Let us know what you got. We'll do our best with the strategy down here. Put ourselves in position at the end. Okay, three play. Now we started off and we were really struggling, just super, super loose, not where we wanted to be. We're still kind of learning, um, you know, these rules and how the cars are going to react. Ooh, two car gets into his left rear. The cars were able to stay really tight together and run side by side. That was a, a dogfight all day, or all night, I should say. You're out there drafting now, so much different than what you've done in the past. Kevin Harvick's third stage win of 2019. It took us a long time to really get where we're good. I don't know if we were fighting the track, continuing to free up as it kept cooling off as well. Strategies going on, two tires versus four, and it was just an up and down night. We were struggling all the way to the end of the second stage, and then Paul Wolf made some adjustments, and we really took off to begin the third stage. Here we come to the flag, and it waves over Chase Elliott. Here they come as we move into stage three. Here's a battle for fifth place. We kind of clawed our way back up. Yeah, I started pitting, and I just didn't want to get jumped by anyone short pitting us. It felt like I was going to come to pit road and just kind of stay in sync with everyone else. Somebody <laughs> lost a wheel. Caution is out. Oh, caution. For that wow. reason, go hard, go hard. It certainly was not looking like our night when the yellow flag came out right in the middle of our pit stop, trapped us a lap down. Thankfully, we were able to wave around and fight back from there. It was what it was, and Brad made the best out of it. And then we caught another caution there. We were kind of just outside the top 10, and not many cars on the lead lap felt like, you know, just come put tires on. Wasn't a big advantage, but knew it was going to be worth a little something. Man, he had a killer restart. Up, up, top of four. Just waiting for an opportunity, and finally an opportunity struck, and we were able to take advantage. Oh, here comes Keslowski to the outside. Bowman couldn't block him fast enough. Keslowski, yeah. new leader. Oh, got you, Benedetto. Oh, it goes here. up in smoke. Caution, caution. Smoking off a two. It'll be two to go when you get the green. Green, white, checkered. Here we go for overtime. Great restart by Brad Keslowski. Brad did a good job executing his restart, getting the lead, and then it left the 88 and the 20 racing side by side. Kislowski is loving this. When he looks in his mirror, those guys are side by side. That's just opening up the door for the two car to do whatever he wants. Two back. That looks like the checker flag. Good job, man. Brad Keslowski wins in Kansas. Hi, four guys. We never give up. That was an amazing run Ooh. by that team right there. Still not going to sit here and say we had the best car at the end, but we had enough adjustments in our car to make it where we were competitive. It feels great. It's good to see that continue to work hard and don't give up. It pays off in the end. I don't know if it's more satisfying to win in a gritty way like today was. You know, because the days where you just dominate, those are fun too. But there's a part of you that really feels like you earned it.